Aries, welcome back to Omkara Tarot and today we'll be doing a uh, money, career, finance, abundance reading for you. Let's see what are the energies around you for that sector and um, well, we'll also take a few cards for advice as to how you could get the best of the month. Alright spirit, money, finance, career for Aries. Okay star card all right okay Aries that's nice king of swords bottom of my deck you'll be very very focused I think if you've been kind of stuck in a situation uh, or you've been waiting for uh, some movement to begin begin to begin Aries if you've been stuck I think there's a major wish of yours coming true major major wish of yours coming true you're going to be finding yourself in a very stable position this is like starting of abundance which is only going to grow and grow and grow and grow and that's coming from you that's coming from your laser focus to get to the ten of pentacles right you may have kept been keeping yourself very isolated maybe working very hard waiting for those results to show up some of you could be studying or working or just you know uh, this is like minute details uh, have been worked upon from what I feel here but Aries that wish of yours is coming true I think in November let's take a few clarifiers and see how that's going to happen what's the hanged man spirit what's the hanged man yep you made up your mind you made up your mind Aries that I have to take back power and control of my own life and you were stuck with that feeling like I'm not going to waver I'm not going to look left I'm not going to look right I make my life decisions I choose to balance out my finances I think uh, the universe has been helping you as well from what I feel there's been a lot of guidance there's been a lot of um, angels universal support and Aries look at this queen of pentacles you've been working so hard so hard maybe to stabilize your life this is a lot of study work uh, single-minded devotion and focus that's been going on Aries in your work and finance so now I guess the time of rewards is here because the star card is here what's the star card spirit what's the star card this is almost divine guidance my god star and the hermit okay one more one more Ace of Swords. Okay, so basically Aries, what it was telling me that you've spent a lot of time in isolation. Maybe you've uh, had some disappointments in the past, and but that cycle is over. Maybe you've been wishing, praying, asking the angels for help. Maybe that cycle has come to a close and you're going to be cutting through all barriers now and making that big wish of yours come true. I don't know what that is. Now, of course, it has to be money and finance because the Ten of Pentacles is here as well. So, Spirit, tell me, what's the Page of Pentacles for November? What's the Page of Pentacles? What's the Page of Pentacles? I told you, a major wish of yours is coming true, Aries. This is like, all right, finally, finally, I made it. I'm in my Ten of Cups. This is... Ten of Pentacles, Ten of Cups, I mean both are here, right? And I told you there's a major wish of yours coming true. And here's the star card once again. My God. All right, so let's take some advice. I don't think you need any. You're getting it directly from the angels uh, as I'm speaking. Maybe you've been getting it for a long time. You've been very, 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 very focused. And uh, you've, it's your decision. You've made a decision that, you know what? This is what I want and I'm not going to budge. So the universe has had no choice but to give you everything that you desire. So my angel spirit guides, what's the advice for my Aries? So they stay on track. Okay. Advice from my angel spirit guides for a swords. Uh, Aries, you can take some time out to rest. You can take some time out to rest. Uh, it'll be a good time to just kind of not overwork yourself the transformation that you're seeking is coming because of all the hard work that you've already put in in the past what spirit guides angels are saying this would not be the time to uh, continue to push 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 it's time to 
say yes i've done the work now universe i'm waiting for you to bring in the trans transformation some of you could be discontent some of you could be saying it's taking so long i've put in that work but you know what whatever you've been waiting for is coming and coming really quickly you don't have to do anything much regarding it i think now will be the time to be in acceptance mode like yes universe i've put in my hard work i've done my prayers i've manifested uh, being back in control back in power i do see the ten of pentacles and the ten of cups uh, uh, and the two star cards right so that means the wishes will come true all you have to do now is sit back yes continue working but don't push yourself give yourself some much needed time to rest recuperate and get ready for this brand new journey that's coming your way all right so let's also clarify a bit of this uh what's the four of swords spirit what's the four of swords yeah you can turn your back to all the troubles of the past i feel here there is because a passionate brand new beginning is awaiting you you may need to rest and recuperate and uh, turn your back now to all the disappointments because when this uh, new journey of yours starts it's going to be quick moving it's going to be exciting you'll need all the energy that you have aries i know aries has no problems in you know that go 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 energy but yes ev every human body gets depleted completed so it's better to saying rest up while you can because when action begins it's going to completely completely transform your life this is death to the old and a brand new life begins so tell me about this big transformation spirit what's the death and rebirth death and rebirth it is don't deplete yourself feeling that if you don't uh, continue putting in the hard work how will i balance my um finances some some of you could have been on that cycle of you know just go round and round and round and round because somewhere you feel if i don't put in the work maybe your finances will be depleted or your self worth will be affected uh, don't don't take that stress uh this is like keeping you chained and bound to a pattern and uh, a cycle of uh less than what you deserve i feel because what spirit is saying when this brand new journey begins there is it's going to take you straight towards your success not just success this is long term happiness long term stability and it's going to make you emotionally very happy so in case you are trying to overwork yourself aries right now i would suggest stand up for yourself put some boundaries up and say no i'm not going to do too much right now this is going to be a time when i am going to take care of me and then watch then watch how the sudden change comes about you old structures will go new life begins and aries you're going to be a crowd puller very very soon it's coming in really quickly very very quickly whatever this uh, wish fulfillment of yours is so tell me about this uh, page of wands what's the page of wands it's going to finally put you into balance aries whatever news there is coming towards you uh, because you've been because you've been strong or maybe you have to stay strong aries through all the past disappointments but if you do stay strong there is a lot of celebration coming to you after maybe maybe a period of a bit of heartbreak things not working out you maybe you were feeling insecure things could have been stagnant you could have been worried that you know what i'm not sure whether my manifestations are coming true because you couldn't see anything right but now there is some brand new energy that is flowing towards you with the page of wands energy so what's the four of cups then spirit what's the four of cups If you've been stuck areas with the feeling of no growth or you haven't got that offer <laughs> that you've been waiting for for some time you are going to be getting unstuck very soon some way your intuition is knocking on your door and very soon that news and that movement is going to knock on your door as well so if any of you are going through a little bit of disappointment and feeling everybody is saying good times are coming good times are coming i don't see it yet and uh, everybody says that i'm going to be in, in a place of fertility abundance joy i don't feel that way what's wrong where is my offer Well, Aries, I think this is going to be the time to just focus on yourself. 
you've already done the hard work you've put your intention out there continue to work as much as you can and let the universe now unfold the the star energy yes the star energy it's going to be an end to feeling uh, lack i feel there's going to be a lot of success coming towards you you're going to be head and shoulders above others uh, Aries very soon people will be watching you looking at you and wondering how you managed to do this I mean from one wand to the eight of wands that's a lot of movement lot of success lot of um, forward movement coming towards you Aries so all I would say is Aries don't don't sit in the lack and don't be worried and don't push yourself too hard. I think the job is already done. Now it's the time of that change over season. So if you just sit back and take some rest, when this movement starts, you'll be very happy. I've already seen the two star cards and the ten of pentacles and the ten of cups. Right? So don't worry. Be happy. Love and light. Take care. Namaste.